What's up, YouTube? It's Eric, a Lions fan. Thanks for clicking on this video. Guys, I kind of want to talk about the Cabrera fight and the Yankees-Tigers brawl that happened last night. Um, I, and I just kind of want to get my take on it. I didn't watch the game, but I watched a YouTube video. I seen it pop up on my phone, and I got up this morning and uh, took a look at what happened here. Uh, I just kind of want to go out and say that I don't think Fulmer intentionally hit Sanchez. I don't know why he thought that there was some intent there. I don't know what led up to that. To that point where they think uh, the intent was to hit Sanchez. I don't know how all that transpired. But <laughs> to the point of throwing at Miguel Cabrera and missing him on top of that. I, I, I would like to know why they thought why they thought to do that. Like I said, I don't think Fulmer was intentionally throwing at uh, Sanchez. Well, and then I'll, it comes out. Girardi comes out and he has a he has a perfectly valid point. He got he ended up getting kicked out of the game, but why weren't both benches warned? At least at least warned. That's that's all that had to be done is warned. If you throw at anybody else again, you're gone. That's all he, that's all the umpire had to say. Well, instead the umpire threw out Yankees pitcher at the time, which again, like I said, I didn't watch the game. And and Joe Girardi comes out. Um, spitting fireballs, more or less, is what it was. And he had, I think he had a perfectly valid point. Uh, and then Cabrera, something was said. Cabrera and the uh, and their the Tigers catcher, I guess, Romine, they were sitting there. He Cabrera said something, took off his mask. Cabrera pushed him and started throwing punches. Now, that doesn't look good on Cabrera either. I'm just going to say. Now, I don't know what exchanged there before then or even – Excuse me, I would, or I even watch it on television. I would. It, it looks bad on Cabrera that <clears throat> that punches were thrown, and he's probably going to get probably going to get suspended probably pretty heavily for it for throwing punches. Um, you, you just can't do that. I mean, you probably can tackle a guy, and maybe get a game or two or three suspension, but when you throw punches, it's gonna it's gonna leave a bad mark on him. Now we all Cabrera's probably frustrated. He has been doing well this year or the last couple of years, so frustration's probably a part of it. I'm not trying to make excuses for the man either. But that had to have been at least some of the, the disappointment and frustration of a season coming out. But again, you just cannot throw punches in any of the leagues here. It doesn't matter if it's the NBA, the NHL um, even though kind of the NHL and fighting kind of go hand in hand, but still they're kind of getting down, they're cracking down on that. Um, the NBA or the NFL, that you just cannot do it or else you're going to get suspended heavily for it or have severe penalties. You just can't do it. Um, yeah, like I said, I hope, I, I, I think now that on the next game, I don't know who the Tigers play. I don't know if this is a, they have one more game with the Yankees or if it's, um, or if this is the last game of the series. It doesn't really matter at this point, but I don't know. We're just going to have to wait and see how uh, Cabrera Cabrera's done here. So, And it's kind of one of the reasons I kind of want to talk about the, the umpires and all that and why they're kind of uniting against Ian Kinsler and all that. And I know I'm probably going off on a little bit of a tangent here, but kind of go along with that. That's why part of the reason Ian Kinsler said what he said was just because of that. Why well, weren't the benches told, look, you throw at somebody else again, and I'm going to start ejecting players. That's all I had to would have been said I'm, for both coaches. Stop the game, get both coaches out there, and all you got to do is tell them that. Or just go to the, the hand signals would have been enough. The, the, the managers would have known what's up. I mean, managers in this in the major leagues, they, they know certain hand gestures and what they mean. So, but Guys, like I said, I'm just giving my two cents on it. Looking at a YouTube video and kind of making sense of what happened, and I watched the Fox, the Fox Sports Detroit, um, their YouTube channel, had it on there. So, guys, let me know what you guys think down in the comments. Do you guys think it was warranted? Do you guys think Cabrera's going to get heavy fine? Do you guys think the, the Yankees instigated it? Put it down in the comments, and also do a like, subscribe as well. And as always, guys, hope you guys enjoy this video, and hope to see you guys again soon. Deuces, guys. Take care.